filming me yet? Yep. Cool. Well, kids, I've got some cheap nail polish on, I've got some cheap eyeliner on, and I've got my bebop hat, so you know what it is. It's poetry time. I'm going to start with a poem I wrote called Homesick. Fundamental wave harmonics distort anew. Twisted limber universe, percussion resonance. Frequent fields of time where they panel beat me, inside out, through anguish unbearable. But they broke their blade on my raw hide. I cried inside the hologram, my kingdom comes. This is it. Take me. I am home. Okay, cats, we got a live feed from... Sammy's bedroom here, and um, well, you've been such a good audience, I'm going to hit you with some spoken word. Mm -hmm. This poem is dedicated to all you women out there that only showed a little bit of romantic interest in me and then left me alone because I'm one of those oversensitive artistic types. You know who you are. One day you'll be very, very sorry. It's called Cupid's Stunt. Love was the thorn that pierced mine heart. Stupid Cupid's poison dart stuck out my breast, love's gaping wound. Blood poured a flame, and I was doomed. At first my soul, and then my head, filled up with longing royal red. My toes transformed to sugar plum pies. Rose-tinted lenses glued over my eyes. I thought you'd like to see me so, especially since tis all for you, and as you became the more divine, I swear I saw your halo shine. But did you notice? Did you care? No, you screwed me once, then left me here. That stupid Cupid, what does he know? Why does that dickhead vex us so? I don't think he can find a girl. So he meddles in our romantic worlds. Vicarious voyeur, get ye gone. I'm wearing armoured breastplates from now on. <laughs> Here on my uh, YouTube channel, you're tuned into Lord Stompy TV. <laughs> this one is one for you all out there. More populist rhetoric. Welcome to the carna fool of your mind. This landscape of mass distraction, flowering proliferously in hanging pots above your heads. Watered continuously, drip, drip, these little brain forests await the shrieking blades. The fields of broccoli await to be harvested. Cut off their heads! If reverse thinking is out of ordure, why does it still go into gear? After all, it's there on the shift stick. Then you're watching your future backwards through the rear window and living far more dangerously. Suddenly, appearing in reverse on a highway going forward to hell with you all. <clears throat> okay. I hope there's no glitches on this. I hope, I hope, I hope there's no glitches on this. I hope there's no glitches on this. I hope there's no... Glitches on this. Final one, this is a uh, strap-on, or rhinoplasty. Rhinoceros horn gives you the horn, certain folks propose. But I think the only thing that grows is the aforementioned proponents' noses. <laughs>